Alright ladies and gentlemen, back in here with the Professor Jermaine and on this day we hit some heavy sets of chest with a lot of volume. We're getting our warm up in right here and the goal for this is not necessarily power but we wanted to get a little power with a little hypertrophy so we set a goal of hitting 205 for 4 sets and here I go getting the first working set in with 205 and actually the first set felt kind of easy. I got through this 15 real nice and easy, but I'm telling you guys, after going through four sets of this, your chest will be burning. Give it a try if you've never done it before. Four sets of maximum weight for 15 reps. Starting your day out with incline. Incline is a good way to hit upper chest. I think all of us tend to be lagging in upper chest, so we hit incline pretty hard. Next, we went up here and done one of my favorite pec exercises. Uh, I'm kind of in a squat position. And this hits upper and mid chest real tight. Key here is lock your elbows, make the chest do all the work, and it is going to burn like I don't know what. Go for four sets of 15 with as much weight as you can tolerate. Keep your rest periods of about 30 seconds in between. It was intense. Next, you see my main man, the professor, getting in his sets. Like I said, guys, this man is a beast. Haven't met many people that can go as long and as hard as I can go in the gym that ain't professionals in something. But this young man, he, he's working towards some goals, and he is in there getting it hard. He's in the gym 5.30 every morning. Usually, he wake me up. But you can see he's keeping it nice and under control. He's got his elbows in a locked position trying to make sure he concentrate on the breathing and he is getting it in. Alright, next we jumped on four sets of heavy dumbbells. And this is after we done done those heavy inclines and the pet. And this guy's just throwing up 75, doing his supinate at the top like it ain't nothing. Nice and easy. And guys, we didn't go 15 on this. We went four sets of eight to 10. This is more of our power exercise and we want to make sure we do still tap that male ego a little bit, get in some power, but keeping it in a rep range where we're still getting a little high purchase. Now here he's getting me getting the 100s and so I'm going to get down here and try to get these 100s for 6 to 8 and my chest is already hurting and shredded. And by the way guys, that is not the Legion of Doom on my t-shirt, that's the powers of pain. If you don't remember them from the WWF days, look them up. But here I go with the 100s, making it look easy in the beginning. But one thing about my muscles, after I done put them through trauma, they will fatigue quick. Just like that. Trying to crank out another one, get it up, get it up, got that one up, and then we're going to fight for another one, and you can forget it. Next, we move on to single pec push and a lot of guys say that you can't stimulate one pec I'm here to tell you that it's a lie one of the things my trainer William Powell has taught me is to isolate muscle groups to figure out what your weaknesses are and on this one we found out that for some reason my right side and pushing motion is a little weaker than the left side I'm assuming I'm compensating for something and so guys give this a try too to make sure that you're balanced Hit this for three sets of 10 to 12. Three sets of 10 to 12. Good way to finish things off. My man, the professor, getting up here, and he was strong as hell on this exercise. At the end of this whole workout, he's still going like a shining star. And guys, that's your quick and fast chest workout. Give it all a try. Let us know how you feel about it. Give us some comments. If you catch us in Gold Gym anywhere in the triad, feel free to jump in with us. Don't forget to like this video. Comment, subscribe. Go out there and get yourself a life game. Give this chest workout a try and let us know how it burns up your chest.